All right, y'all hanging out with my boy Travis Rogers, chief, chief engineer for the Return to Forever crew. He getting me the, the, the big hookup backstage, checking out Lenny White Drums kit. For all y'all uh, wanna be drummers, this is how they do it. My goodness. Hey Travis, explain to us real quick if you can. You know, I know you Lenny, he's about the big sub and, and the fan. What does and all that? Kind of give me a little. Well, the fan is just a typical just a fan. fan, just to keep him cool. The sub is give him a lot of low end. Um, on the kick drum. So now, being a uh, being a sound tech and like the drummer, that's, that's not too loud on them. No, no, just a low end. You know, Lenny likes that in a butt thumper. A who? Jim Moran <laughs> can explain these drums better than I can. Well, well, Jim busy right now, so we gonna leave him alone. <laughs> hey, Jim, you want to give us a quick uh, talk sure. about on uh, how Mr. White got his drum kick set up and what you do? Well. Uh, we use Innovation Drums, it's a, a small boutique company out of Detroit, Michigan, right here in the United States. Uh -huh. And um, the question that you're asking about is his butt kicker. His butt kicker is uh, on the bottom a of transducer seat. that's connected to the bottom of his rock and sock seat. And the amplifier here takes a signal of send from the Soundcraft board over there in monitor land. So when he kicks his kick drum, it sends the signal back through the amplifier and then up through his butt with the butt kicker. Okay. So you can feel it right here in your... <laughs> in your hiney. In your bottom. Oh, this Lenny White's drum tech spelling the butt kicker and all the, the rest of the stuff that goes along with doing a big gig like this. Yep, we use... Uh, yeah. He loves this fan, this Dyson fan. Right. Uh, he had to have that. He can cool. <laughs> I think it's more to blow his, uh, his little do-rag than anything else. But... <laughs> Uh, we use Istanbul Agap cymbals, and we use Remo heads and oh. Vic Fur sticks. Man. And then he has his own signature stick. <laughs> like a, right in the middle of a yeah, you're right. 5A oh, yeah. and a 5B. Okay. It's really beautiful weight. It's got its own uh, design to it. All right, Vic, you're going to have to send me my residuals for this uh, free, free uh, interview you're getting about your sticks now. Once again, y'all. J. Ross TV behind the scenes at the RTF concert, uh, 10 million strong. Uh, just getting the, the big look, see on what's going on. Man, Lenny got it going on. Yeah, it's, just, it's East Coast kid. <laughs> All right, we're going to move over to the bases. Golly, man. Stanley got some beautiful bases. My goodness. All you, all you aspiring musicians who want to be on a world-class tour, my goodness. This is, what, this is how they do it. <laughs> 